Good to have you here. I want to learn all about Exact Data, ExactData.net. Yes. Yep. And um, and what you guys, what, what what got you into the business? We were. Uh, I was actually at Kodak at the time. Mm. Eastman Kodak. Uh, I was having a great time there. Great company. Mm. Yeah. Um, really treated me well. But uh, we were working some neat uh, technologies in the uh, document imaging space, mm. and uh, we came up with this idea about. Um, uh, doing similar things for data processing applications that we're doing in the imaging space and uh, um, thought it was really super cool. Um, there are a lot of applications for it and uh, the environment at Kodak at, at the time wasn't something where we'd be able to get funding or try to get that right. commercialized. Um, at the time in the early 2000s they were you know, downsizing and it was just a tough financial situation so we ended up, uh, uh, I was in a position where I could get uh, funding to bridge funding because of my position in the company and um, we went out and started up a company and uh, haven't looked back since. So mm. many great companies start that way, right? Yeah. Where there's yeah. like a parent, um, big firm people meet, they have ideas, it's not the right environment, they go off and great things happen so all the time. That's, yeah. a, that's exciting. Yeah. That's exciting. Were you up in Rochester? At the time? Yeah, Rochester, New York. Yeah, uh, moved there to work for Kodak and then yeah. uh, bounced around a little bit, but mm -hmm. uh, um, my, met my wife there, so we, mm -hmm. you know, live there now, stay there now. So the so company, you're, uh, where, where, where are you guys headquartered? Uh, how are you set up? You know, what, what, what? Uh, uh, Rochester, New York. Place? Rochester. Um, yeah, we, most of our business is U.S. federal, so we travel to D.C. almost on a weekly basis. Mm -hmm. um, we, how do you get from Rochester to Washington? Is there a shuttle? Uh, we do fly, but we drive a lot. <laughs> it's, drive. it's uh, yeah, it's a six-hour drive. It's not yeah. bad, so. Um, get a lot of work done in the car. That's good. That's yeah. good. So the whole team's up there. Yes. Um, well, we have uh, one person down in the D.C. area, mm. but uh, for the most part, we're up in Rochester. With the D.C. DC mm. are those the federal applications they more on the defense side, civilian, or maybe, maybe both? You've probably done both. They're they're almost all civil uh, to date. We we have done some um, Intel apps, mm -hmm. um, which is pretty exciting. Um, we'd like to get into the DOD, mm -hmm. which is a you probably know, had some a little DARPA work that you may have uh, yeah we did we, in, yeah. yeah we have done mm -hmm. work for the DOD too, mm -hmm. um, but we uh, would really like to get out of uh, the federal marketplace and get into commercial applications. <laughs> uh, the, uh, There's a lot of commercial organizations that would like to get into federal. Yeah, it's uh, the decision making process in the federal doesn't always have to do with <laughs> ROIs and um, you know what's best for the company or or. You know, for the for the uh, what's going on there, so.